friends today we will see what is gps we all know what is gps gps is global positioning system gps was originally meant for military purpose only so militaries needed a very accurate estimates of the latitude longitude and altitude so to find out the exact position of the target they wanted this accurate pinpointing system called as global positioning system how does gps work gps is implemented from the space in other words we need several spacecraft to implement the gps okay gps as the name suggests is a system okay it is not a stand alone spacecraft so it is a system okay then the gps that we are having in our mobile phone are gps receivers okay uh, for this gps we use radio waves radio waves are part of the electromagnetic spectrum and they travel at the speed of the light which is 186000 miles per second okay so how it is implemented we will now find out the basis for the gps okay suppose we are stranded somewhere on the surface of the earth and we do not know where we are and we are lost okay suppose in that situation if we receive a signal from one of the space craft with the time stamp in it what happens is that there are several space crafts uh, that are orbiting the earth the purpose of the gps space craft is to send the continuous signal what will be there this signal the signal will consist of the time stamp okay so your our gps in our receiver receives that time stamp when we receive the signal from the gps satellite it means that we are somewhere within the range of the gps okay so where we are exactly so that is a process to find out that is a process we will see how we are doing it okay suppose if we receive a signal from one of the spacecrafts with the time stamp in it suppose the spacecraft sends a signal and we receive it after say half a second or one second suppose we receive after one second what does it mean it means that we are somewhere along the circumference of the circle like as we are pointed as it is pointed at now okay so somewhere we, here we, that point could be here 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 anywhere it is there is a infinite small number of uh, points here so we do not know where we are exactly but we know where we might you might find us okay where somebody might find us we know okay then now what happens so suppose we receive one more signal from another spacecraft what happens is that this was the first signal that we obtained okay we could be somewhere here okay here 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 somewhere we might be here so we do not know where we are exactly suppose this is the uh, this is a signal that we received from some other spacecraft okay we are plotting a circumference circle like this okay so now we the point where these two circles uh, intersect is a and b you could be either at a or at b okay so you cannot be found anywhere here or here or here or here you could be found either here or here okay so now still we are not found out the location pinpoint location of where you are stranded up or where we are stranded up okay we need one more signal for that so see this system see this third signal that we received okay this is the first signal that we received and this is the second signal we received so from this second signal we came to the conclusion that either we have to be here or here the signal from the second spacecraft three say that you are either in the you are in the point a or in point b it said 
it could be either in point a or in point b suppose we get another signal from the third space craft so the circumference is plotted like this okay now we have pinpointed the location you can be only in this in this point okay so this is the gps so as you increase the number of spacecraft that send you the signal the accuracy increases okay so that is how the gps works and uh, uh, india has got its own gps it is called navic okay this consists of seven satellite system orbiting from pole to pole it is specifically meant for india the usa has got a very robust uh, gps system it can it covers the entire uh, year every country it covers okay that is what gps is all about time has to be very accurate in this gps so the heart of the gps is time and this heart of the gps is atomic clock because we are dealing with electromagnetic radiation that is radio waves which travel at the speed of light at the rate of 186000 miles per second even if there is a small nanosecond difference or nanosecond error between the sender and the receiver the, our uh, gps system will not be robust and will be off the mark by hundreds of meters therefore in gps we use only the atomic clocks from a simple concept in the coordinate geometry we have derived this system called as gps or global positioning system we will be seeing more of these kind of uh, videos in our channel kindly subscribe to my channel to get more of these kind of videos thank you goodbye